You don't want to it's stand. It's because the uh, spoonbills will poop right there, so you don't want to get pooped on. And there's birds around everybody's feet, so everyone needs to be really careful. And um, <laughs> this little this little mammal behind us is a dwarf antelope called a blue diker, and her name is Lily. Can I help you? Would you like that? And um, she's going to smell everybody's shoes. And lick yeah. this all Lick us a little bit. Maybe lick me because I'm all sweaty. Yeah. And um, dwarf antelope, um, this particular species is actually um, monogamous. So rather than, excuse me, can I help you? Huh. Um, <laughs> rather than living in a herd, they live in pairs huh. and they have babies. Um, there's, this is a beautiful golden pheasant. Yeah. So we're going to throw out a few worms for everybody. And this is a purple gallinule or a swamp hen, the one that's bugging me right here. Look at it brought you, sweetie. You're not looking. No. There, there you go. go. And um, back here is an Argus oh. pheasant, which is an Indonesian pheasant. They're the largest of all the pheasants. Now, does anybody want to feed them yet? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm just going to hold it. And she might eat it too because <laughs> Lily's actually an omnivore. Pull this out and she'll take that out of your hand. Oh, I'm very salty. Oh, boy. I'm so salty. I'll just help myself. You're you like a salt lick. Mm -hmm. They may or may Brownie. not take it out of your hand, but um, the. Oh, hey, look. Look. Mmm, them's good worms. There's another one. She eating them? Oh, Isn't yeah. That funny? Yeah, so these um, little antelope are interesting because actually. In the wild, they've been known to eat um, birds and their eggs. But why huh. do we have her in the aviary? <laughs> that uh, seems silly. But actually, because she's so well fed. Um, excuse me. You are, you are just okay. You can have one, but that's all. Oh, oh friendly. Okay. Uh, you're friendly too. So this is a Kenya crested guinea fowl. Remember, we saw the vulturine guinea fowl and the and the um, helmeted guinea fowl. This is another guinea fowl. This is very rare. And then this back here is a type of a plover called a lap-winged plover. The um, golden pheasant is just starting to get his um, really beautiful plumage back because after the breeding season, they molt really dramatically, and then um, and then they get their feathers. So back. is this so, <clears throat> this one's yeah. partner coming over here? Uh, yeah, this is a male, um, a male and a female. Hi, Lily. He's not yeah. quite as. He's Friendly. not quite as gregarious as Lily is. Oh, Isn't she something? Aren't these the silliest birds? Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Oh, you want one too? Okay. Oh, this is a new one. Look at this cutie under here. That's a Madagascar. It's either a pigeon pheasant or a pheasant pigeon. I think it's a pigeon pheasant, a Madagascar pigeon pheasant. I love all those marks. Oh, so amazing. Isn't it amazing how nature creates all these amazing yeah. birds? Come on, you go over there. Oh, really? Uh, Alan shoes oh, are there, okay. You are just so bold. Aren't you just the boldest little thing? Oh, up high in the tree. Oh, look up. Watch this. Let me try this. Ooh, look at that. Wow. Did you get it? Good job, I think so. Not one of the other critters will. It's a lilac breasted roller huh. from southwestern Africa. Oh, I don't know. See, he hasn't gotten all of his feathers yeah. symmetrically on his cape. So eventually that orange cape will cover the green. Wow. Careful. Look at the assortment. And the ducks over there are baby white-faced whistling ducks. They're just starting to get big. Hold your hand out like that, maybe you'll lick it. You don't want her to lick you? Yes. She's pretty cool. I'm getting a whole leg massage here. Yeah. You want to you pet worm? <laughs> yes, you can have some more. This guy's just starting to get food. Wow. Careful. 
careful you're not standing in the poopy spot. Yes, those little roseate spoonbills, man, they watch for you. They probably go, oh, there's a target. Are you getting ready for me? Sorry, I just no. didn't want you to step on her feet because she's very delicate. That, you know what? That's kind of borderline biting. So let's, um, maybe you just lifted the scab off. It felt like you bit me. I think she licked my scab off. I think I can get the rollers to go again. There he is. Okay, let's try this again. Uh, I guess we're just going to sprinkle. Yeah, Everybody go get your wormies. Isn't she soft? Yeah. Good job petting her. She's kind of nice, huh? I'm good with animals. Are you good with uh -huh. animals? Yeah, I use them a lot. It's really nice to have you calm and gentle in here. because I then I don't... some stick bugs. Did you? You know what? Uh, Kimberly, who works here.